the voices on the king. We hear the voices ring. They'll be singing out that Marie of the land. The river Jordan over here. The sounds of trumpets you be hear. And you behold the most precious words in a mountain land. Across the breeze, there is no sorrow. Across the breeze, there is no more pain. They start on shore, across the river. And you never be afraid again. Across the breeze, there is no more sorrow. Across the breeze, there is no more place. The sun will shine across the river. On the river, we are happy. Amen. Meanwhile, as we take our lunch, can I invite the chairman to us to one of these? Chairman is one of these higher priests and it's the call. He gave us a speech. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Allow me to talk in the local language. Because most of the people here are local here. Uh, Kwa mkisakuno kwa tangi ya. Uh, Zee kivinda kwa karakazi wa genzi wa nganyakuli hanu. Kwa kuija hamkono kuno kwa uchune. Kwa tuwale iwe enganjani ya itu Titus Kajura. Mwepale kuweleksa yona kukwinjo kuemela amuna ito mkaili pana kwa mjune Akea lukine kia kia mwita elo siwa Pika ando wot Chikuli ya division Masini municipality, masini district Alo maiso kanyu Mama rakami nyoto sime ke moze sate nyo mchwa Pisewa rongo Bachea pasona elo si tu umu kwa kuno kwa hivika ando Chea pasona elo siwa antasowele kuwa anu mwaiti Kwa hitu kwa hitu kwa hitu kwa hitu kwa government ya LOC tuwe kwa hitu kwa kinu Ni nkulikia hala vana wa mugenzi Hala mfakati Madam Imachulate Umunyanyo mugenzi Haba Zaire Haba Titus Umumbaju zombi Patano ane matano Hapuani Nganjani Abali hano, waka mets, abali hano. Na inyue no sabia imitakusa. Mwevali kuija, ukuma otuwe waka iso, msendekeleza kantuzika enganja ni Titus. Titus, kawumanya, otuwele ntuzika mama uwe hano, Nkabomo wa MC na mgenzo wa ngekuluka kisasi, ali MC hati. Mwina manjini mkuru wa kutaitas, baitu mkamura kumsaita mwazi ya vatu. Kandi, hako ina vulo omu. Ito nkabanyoro, we have lost a great man. Habu ukuba, matukole hile hanu mkubiyerora. Bahinu ili kichoka kia itukune kia kia mwita hello see you one. Kale no kusamila na wanyo ravandi nyue na wala heru ya unyoro Ensefi muzikale muka Ukwa liike chukusemba yu Mkusawa anti Avanti ya wanyoro Mika ampala Baitu mbiki okuroro wa mka familie Nunaini mka ale sete muka Yusaka minu yu na mbuwe Mkuzi wa inde municipalite Mkuluko kusawa kwa Tikuwe na kula andaika Baitu mkuwe na kwa tangi Ya na muno fana waitu Ataka ikali ni mwotewe Waitu Reverend Afad Hamune Kerezia Mwewale kuhitia Okuhitia mkwa kune kitinisa 
na yenyewe na bali hano omitini sabiyani ebi kwa wakana nebe ebike omuke nziki taitas kajura lot mukama amweki umre kirongi haruke noro wakua sire na ito notuke nebe ebike kama bakarina usinge murawa na mchawa makakas thank you Thank you, Chairman, for the 21st speech. Michael MC, can I start from there? Why to Kumkulemi Zivik Chokakinu, Aruli Ngorwa, LC2, Kandi, Ayemere Ile, Mukikaro, C1 Chairperson, to see Miramuni Vikango via Wavio, Kandi to see Miramuno, to Ikiriza, Okuahano, Nitkore Magak Semayo, Titus Kajura. Lord Sancho, mwenye kilize manyire abantubanu, abanyakuizire hanu, no, oktu kwa sizaho, okuzika. Kine, a clan chief, dukot, okuruga, guru, omukuru, a Mr. Nyeko, Andrew, Nawe Ahirahano, Kandi Nahamuna team, Yaguru, Bali Bazaire Baitu, Abaguru, Batangi Ramuno. Ah, to in a clan over Urugana to get a prime minister, Ukuruga, Guru, Naiwe to Kutangi Rire, Omukuru, Kinera, John Bosco. Ah, Mwenyikirize manyire omuhandi ke mkuru okuruga ministro yevye nyikiriza omurufutifut permanent secretary minister of education. You are welcome. We recognize your presence. We also recognize the presence ruined into manyira okuwa hokuwa director of budget, Mr. Laban Muramuko. Ah, you are my OB. Remember that? Nice meeting you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. So, Mr. Muramuko, you are welcome. The director budget. And the director, Jennifer Muhuruzi. Please wait for the people. Jennifer Muhuruzi, tia kwene. Eh, mutani hai hanu. Kionka barawai zile. Kura manyira nawe. Tuina commissioner. Usai ni kabi angi singoma, mwana nzaro ya hanu, yemero na mkia wata. Commissioner and Minister of Finance, mubarora wa wantu bakuramu. Tuina Paul Mwanja. Paul Mwanja, you are welcome. We have Juvenile Muhumuza. You are welcome. We have Muhammad Kabale. Those are commissioners in the Minister of Finance. Moses Kabanda. Moses Kabanda. We have Angela. Ruabutomisa. Angela, you are welcome. The MC Kampala, all those pro programs. We were with her in Kampala as MC. Oizira Nuna Weki. We were the Koromulim Murongi, Kampala. Twina uh, Samson Mwanguzi. Yes, a man of the people, they say. Oh, thank you. Uh, we also have other staff members from Minister of Finance. And uh, uh, from Minister of Finance, Planning and Economic Development. If you are a senior officer, please stand up. Mwemere. Sam, I want you to stand up. I don't know your level. Please, you also stand up. Sam, stand up. Stand up. You stand up. You are my OP. You stand up. So, I want to recognize Sam. He's my colleague for a long time. So, you are also a senior citizen here. Yeah. Yes, thank you. Uh, uh, can we have, we also want to recognize that.
Assistant Commissioner Office of the President. Nyakaisiki Monica, mwana waitu wani yemera. Abantu wa kumanyira, abantu wa kurole. Nyakaisiki Monica. Okay. Mrs. Susan Mohumuza Nyatia. Where? Oh, there. Thank you for coming. Director. Uh, okay. Mrs. Mohumuza Nyatia is from Uganda Registration Services Bureau. Abahanika, Abahanika, Rundi, Abakuera, Sivo Marriages, Alitukuzehanik, Sizan. Now, marriage is a zip zone. We have director Okecho, Bank of Uganda. We have a community team present to go to the community team. The lions. Huh? Lions was a tapunion. Enter is Rohan. But he can enter the city. Please move the lady the lion. Oh, yes. Represent president. The lion is a man. They are there. It's a new one. It's a win your own. You can come on the we want to recognize our parents from Abazaire Waitu, Abakuruga Fort Potro, Mutuhubira, Abazaire Waitu Kuruga Toro, Mwemale Kuija, Abazaire Waitu Kuruga Guru, Mwemale Mwemale Zoho, Mwemale Kuija, Banyuani Waitu, Abazaire Waitu Kuruga Seguku, Amo Nakajans, Mwemale Kuija, Nanyi Tumatangirile. We now to Kumanyi Rama Board Members, from Naro, you know Sancho was all round. But one of our was over, Titus Lord Janso, Lord Sancho, Akawa in the Haka Quarte on a personal level and even on an administrative level. The Hona Kavana Korayo, Rundi Bona Kavanava Manya, Uno, Staff Minister of Local Government. Where are you? We recognize your presence. Okay? Thank you very much. Sherry <laughs> Rundi umkusaba, wabara tu garura tina roka no, kujia kanika representatives, abata wanya kurukire Saint Saint's Estate, alamu kenzi abaya ina maka, orohari mukenzi ina maka, ni nyamu ya kwanza kuramu kia wazi kwa itu, kandi nuto gamera hoveke au kony mui. Na taita skajura owire wa mani. Kuija kusaba kajans progressive senior secondary school. Batu heho evika mbibiri, unibisatu. Seguku parents. Prepare. Friends. Omuta kenda kuwaza harumaju wabanyuani omu. Bakajura. Oweno yete kaneza. After that, tuja kuwana wa jima. Children, children. Miriam Rwanga, we take a nice Ojapon or to Maksa Hibka Mubimiri. Dimako Sipseraf, to Ijakurana Miriam Muizuche, will give us some remarks. Then to Ijakurana Friends of Charity, Alexandro Sista. Then we will require government leaders, LOC to Chapasso Namazire. As a representative of LOC3, district leaders, then councillors, and then district leaders. 
Ene tujakuwa na Minister of Finance Baja kutuheleza okutumwa wahu Tujakusawa abene wahu na wanyanya uh, omugezi Neba kulemerwa anti-maturate Banga mire cha chegenda umdaki kanta ikumi na itane kwenye itanika Kionka imakule tuwaruga ho na banyanya Tuja kweta bana mwumukenzi Abana mwumukenzo para amara Tuja kweta wazaire baitu Abakuruga Fort Potro Mwete kanize mutaya mtu Aratura mkiao Kani na waratu herizo kutuma Tuja kuwa baftoro para amara Tuja kuwa na mufakati Fakata <laughs> Evi kama evi kusema yo Nuko umkoro tukukarulika Ekelezia Tukende haki karukia itu Echi kusema yo Kionga kanukara ango Ya kakaru kame minundi nyingi Famire Hama na vana Masavire Rundi bateka nizi Kutura amara kuzika Tiba kuija Kukoro mkoro kusaviro mkwetua Tuija kumara hane viro Dina Nena kiluki akana Reverend Father Tuija kuija koro mkoro Kanda sabiri na mkwetua Na hawe kifamire nikie sabiri Kwa wamanyi sa Mti tuija kwa ntuki aro hanu Kukumara viro vina mungeso Rundu mumirua Yabunyoro Na toro Mkunira na gulu Kari mwivali muno Atuli nire Reverend Father Lejata Andike Lemisi Now I'm requesting those one who are seven foot to stop because it is now time for the mass. As we told you, we are going to continue serving after the mass. We beg you kindly, only those one online, only those one online, please get food. No more people before the mass. We beg you kindly. Did you give us a slot as we are winding up?
Mwenye kilise barukenya anjiro mtu mkuru ni wena mbagambi yege Omukiara ritoli Ni wako handika Okutumwa wona guizi na gomkoro kwa ito hana Na wako mkutandi kilao Hawako wekenu Oinakurami raho Nohora dipositinge kita Ni wakiku yao ni wakituara Wanyo hani wekenu Oguya ambi wona Nogutumwa wona kusigara hali Mwenye kilise nyongiro kumanyira Mr. Samuel Wandera, Director of Final Services, Financial Intelligence Authority, and your wife, Helen. Please, wave at me. Hey, Bobby. Sha. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, Commissioner David Kingi from Minister of Finance. Who is the, who is the boss of Immaculate? Commissioner David Kingi, where are you? David Kingi. The control is coming, but we would like to see because the, the boss of Immaculate. Rosemary Mutiabule, Director Enterprise Uganda. Rose Mutiabule, ah, she's here, you're welcome. Commissioner Jody Yarohanga, uh, Tax Policy, Minister of Finance. Yes, you're welcome. Where are the go.
Hello, hello. Uh, Hati Reverend Father and in Abutani Kamisa. Nahaweki ampa in Ocean Runa and Awee. Yakumpe Daki Kamakumiana. Nizoni Nakubalism speak is an Kumiavi. Speak in Makumiavi, Daki Kamakumiana. Good speech, Daki Kaivi. Reverend Reverend Father. Professor as a board member and for quite some time. So Professor Bua will also have remarks uh, to speak on the, this occasion of sending off our dear brother, our dear son, Lord Sanchiko. Thank you. <coughs>
Kino ni tukisaba ni tulaba mkwisto mkama waito Aisi ito mnyambabazi kandi ruhango muhumuza Iwe nyakutu gonza utolekera Iwe nyakufu wa rakitu ule kiurufu rukia kia rubomezi Tukwesengirize Uhumuza ya mwaza mweza wa wano Uwe hile umuose Kandi umano wawo mkama waito mkoku ya tujani lorufu Na tufera ya tukaru rubomezi na mbuka Tukwesengirize Otuwe Okumuhone rangano kuwa mkiro kimu Obotumu mlimara kufa
Tusuliza hano mwibale situ Nili ya mwana, nili ya moyo mwikirire Mukama abena inyue Bagenzi vange mkristo ni matangira Mwikeno Yetaitas Na mbele turu kusavira Kande ni tuja kuzika Mwabili wa mwana waitu ono Taitas Tumusavire na mtima kwa yetu guona Tusavire mkiarawe Tusavire abekaye Kandi na buona wele ni wakora na we Ni wakora na we Mukama asaholo kwa gomia Beka tuzire nsuviza ito Nukutuwe mkize mukama esareno Ninyatura kumaisu kwa ruhanga Omsobozi wabiona Omsobozi wabiona First reading, a reading from the book of Ap Apocalypse, chapter 14, verse 13. And I heard a voice from heaven saying, write this, 
Blessed are the dead who from now on die in the Lord. Yes, says the Spirit. They will rest from their labors and for their deeds will follow them. The word of the Lord. Thanksgiving for the gift of life 
which he gave to our son Titus Amote, who has concluded or concluded at the beginning of this of last month his course of existence on earth. We are grateful to God. Just I used to, I said last evening, mass is a sacrifice of thanksgiving to God for the benefits he has and for the graces he has given to us. Christ has already done much for us and we thank God in the first place that God saved this man, Titus. He is a man who loved God, who served God, and who sought to be enlightened always by God. I have interacted with a few family members and I have come to know that Titus was a man who really loved his faith to an extent that he did not want to live in a marriage which is not consecrated in holy matrimony. When he met the beloved lady, Barbara, she took her to church. And at this moment, they had made 20 years in matrimony, holy matrimony. And he has been always active in the church, not only in the church, but transforming his faith into living faith by being lovely, being loving in his workplace, and that is evident by the people with whom he works, or he was working, who are present here. You are a living testimony that Titus has been a good man and has been loving and substantial in your lives. We are proud as people from Masindi, from this parish, to have such a good younger man committed to God, committed to his family. We are thanking God that the fruits of our efforts in spreading the gospel formed a fertile ground in the life of Titus. And it's not only Titus who is religious in his family, but also the other family members, they are good Catholics. And it's a good example for us all. I thank God, or we thank God, for the grace which, God, which he gave to Titus of having a good wife. All wives should be good. But I'm saying a good wife. <laughs> Not all wives are able and ready to sacrifice their lives to suffer with their companions up to the last moment. In this moment, I thank God who, and the family of uh, Madame Barbara. Maybe we have the daddy here. Maybe it will, that the daddy to Barbara stands up and we, we thank him. He is the, we thank you so much for nurturing well your daughter. And this family is grateful. In very few words, I have interacted a bit with uh, Barbara, but I've come to know she has been a wife who is present. A wife who is present in the family. Not all wives are present. They can be in a family, but when they're not present, mind and body and heart. And she has been nearer to his husband up to the last moment and when he was taken abroad. It's not easy to be outside the country, outside your country. I stayed outside. It's not simple. And once still when you are with a sick person, I was there for other motives, but it is painful and disturbing when you are abroad. And this lady really worked hard and was present accompanying Titus in his last days, moments in life. And I believe 
that he lived much longer than he would have lived because of a good wife. May we give a hand clap? Well, that is a moment not to worry about a hand clap. But I really, and we are praying for you before God that the love which you have had with, you have shared with him remains. And it will remain because the love is a gift from God. And friendship is given, is a gift from God. I believe the good seeds which Titus sowed in his family will last because because the length of life, the beauty of life is not calculated on its length. The beauty of life is not calculated on how many years one lives, but it depends on how much one has loved. Christ loved, showed love in only three years, but the whole world is mad with the love of Christ. So Titus has lived a short life. I hear 50 or so. But it has left an imprint in the lives of many. For that to return glory to God. I was preaching here last evening and I I was telling the people who were present that when the that came to talk to us to agree about on how to have mass, the way that celebrate these uh, mysteries. For us here, for those who do not know, that we celebrate mass when for people who receive sacraments, the priests. It is a policy of our diocese. Because there are many people who don't want to. to Barbara who, con who thought about that and uh, connected the heart to receive the sacraments. When one intimately to Christ, says the Lord in chapter 6 of verse, in fact, chapter 6 of the gospel according to John. And he was nourished by the body of Christ, blood of Christ, and receive the sacrament. Yomuntu atuunga, ijonga kenda kusigira mzei deo komorubuka, ijonga walizehuka na watu genzero. Ake hurakubi, ya sawa kumsigira. I went there in the afternoon, of ijonga kenda yu nya msiga ntaka izile kono. A shortly, two, hardly two hours after the anointing, he passed on. And we pray also for him. He's our head of the late Jefferson Vice Council, Namikisa. He's dead. And we are praying also for him to the good Lord. So, what was he trying to say? The anointing of the sick. It is the sacrament. A sacrament. He's in safe hands. And that's why I chose this reading, the first reading of today. St. John, the, the evangelist, wrote, Akahandika, Yohana, Nagamba, Akahurira, Kalirugomu, Iguro, Nirigamba, Liti. Uomogi, Saogu, Anyakufa kana kafeira mumukama. Uomogisa anyakufa kana kafeira mwili mukama. Habu waki. Habu wakuma ahumura omuwasinge kuruga mire moye. Kandi, ebikuru wabia birongi, ebi yaba ya kozere, bimuhondera. Amina. 
Amina. Amina. Na wewe tu no kumia. Peter sana kufedi na mukama aliwamugisa. He is blessed. He who dies in the Lord. He is happy. Who dies in the Lord. Peter has died in the Lord. Will you die in the Lord? Gentlemen, ladies, will you die in the Lord? Are you in the Lord right now? Are you subsisting in the Lord? The answer is in your heart. But get married in the church. This is not a sacrament which is not useless. The sacrament of marriage and sacramental life is very important. And it's the primordial sacrament from creation. God created one man, one woman. And he blessed them. We have many of Ugandans who are polygamous. And the one who receives sacrament, some of them sneak. They sneak in the evening. I'm going for, for a seminar in Kampala. The seminar is already on the street. Sit down, gentlemen. Sit down. And the ladies sometimes also, it happens. But that is... Be unbound. Sometimes the body binds us. It keeps us tight. We can't enjoy life on the body. So he is unbound and he will be unbound in order to live fully the life of Christ. We pray for the family. We pray. The family is still young. But God is present. He's watching. He's guarding. Nobody lives for himself. And nobody is able to look after the other. It's God who looks after us. Even if we think by our energies we can do, we can work hard, but it's God who permits us. We pray and comfort and request the friends of, uh, of Titus to remain near to the family. If you have been good friends anyway. If you have been good friends, remain. Titus is not, uh, he has not disappeared by the way. He's around. And he's watching all of us here. Because when you have died, you become free. The body limits us. Outside of the body, we are unlimited. So he's not limited. He's looking at us in an instant. He's able to look here, there, there. For me, I cannot look there because I'm limited by the body. I have to fast turn. But the one who has, been, who has left aside the body is the soul. Always the glorified body is able to see. So... If you have been good friends, keep friends. Keep with the family. They will return a deficit in Kampala. Those in Kampala, you keep around. Keep with this family. It's a younger family. It's a good family. And God will reward you abundantly. I'm grateful to Father Paul from Gaiaza who has come to join us. That is also a good testimony that Titus has been a child of God, a prayerful person. Well, the director said, I didn't ask you for the document because he has not been uh, staying in the village here. Sometimes we ask for documents to authorize us to officiate because we have not been knowing that. But uh, because we have a family which is prayerful, the Kikoro, <coughs> where he's born, is a good family, and the sisters and the brothers, we collaborated. And this, even if he has been a Christian in that parish, he has been also taking responsibility in this parish also. Trying to know what is going on here and where possible come in to support the church. For all these graces we are grateful. The Lord be with you. Let us now stand up to offer to God some intentions for the soul of Titus.
Mali, ni wensoro yoku ikirile buona. Tukwe sengeli zotu memo ya wawa ya zevi sembo vino, nukwa mitu fokere, mubiri na sagama ya mukama waitu ya zu kristu. Uwe obye gondizo kubane sewa, akakwato mugati, ya sima, ya kuitu wamo, kandi ya kuwa beke sewa ave na gambati. Mukwate, mulie hoinyuena, gunu, nukwa mubiri kwange, ukurahe wayo hawanyo. Umuringo nguo gumo wa mazire kulia ya kuwa chile kikompe na wea sima Kande ya kia wekese wabe na gambati Mkuwate mwenye hoi nyuena Kino ni kikikompe ya kisagama yange Ya kilagane ya kihiaka kande ya kitahu waho Ya seso hawanyo na wabengi ya kubagai nze vivi Kino mkikoleke huko nyituka Ifubo hili kuikiri zandeno, kristu ukatufeda. Kristu maumuka, kristu ikaifa. Habwe keno aimu kama, nituijuka okufa na kumuka okumwana wawe, nitukuhongera umugati guwabu mezi na kikombe iti okutunua. Nitukusima habwe kutusobo zesa, ukwemera umaisu gawe na kukuheleza. Nitukusaba na kutulezi, ituena abanabaka na hamubi nisagama ya kristu, moe muikiri hile atele nisege hamu. Aimu kama ujuka bantuba wabu monsio na wajuzengo nzisa hawe. Ujuke na papa waitu Francis, umarulezi waitu Vincent, na bona wa sorelu mbandi okora okorimu kwa hawe. Ujuke umuheza wa wetaitas. Wa hile omuz. Wa mtuara na mbehoi. Obwa wakuba, omubatisimu, akafahamu na kristo. Omuhe, okugabana, okumbuka kwe. Ojuke, na uganda ruitu, abaka fire, na banihara. Okuhumbuka na bandi wona abafire. Obaikirize okuijia na mberi hori. Tukwese ngeleza. Otuganyire yituena. Noko tusemere. Tusemere. Okutunga obumezi obutahwa ho. Ahamu Nipikire Maria Ninaruhanga Abatumwa Abaichirire Na abachirire Bona Abakusemirize Bachari omunsi Tukuhaise Kandi Tukuhigize Nituraba Omwana wawe, Yesu Kristo. Nituraba omuwe, kandi tuli hamu nawe, tuli nomuliwe, okukwaisa na okutaba kitini sakiona, iwe ruhangai situwe, omusobozi wabiona, hamu na mwe muikiri hile, hivido na hivido. Amina. Pekato esengeleze, omulingu yesu kusegisiza batumu habe, Habe ni abuwe ni emaze, istrupe gomba na mnamono, obuide wono ntugamba, isi itwe aromo ikuru. Ibali ya ulitinwe, okama kwa wiki, nilo konza ikoro mwusi, okwe hati, okwe kwa wiki, okwe nye wiki ya itu, okwe kwa wiki, 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 ok Kando tukire mbabazi, otuofu singo mbomezi kwa ito. Habu kukonye nwa mbabazi zao kutuosa tutabuke vivi. Kandi tukireke mbikabi kona, tutekeleze okunira kukusemele nwa. Na ukuita kwa mtu ni waitu, Yezo Kristo. Habu kubaniwe mkama, niwe nukusobu nekinesa, hebido nebido. 
ayi mukama yezu kristo yagambira abantu mwa bawote mbasigire obusinge obusinge bwange bwa hayire otarere bibe tibaitu rokwiza abantu bawo kandi koko rugonza ukwiza koko obusinge rokwateriza hamo iwe mera no rema ebiro ne ebiro obusinge bwa kristo tuletire bwe nanya winywena
Koko turuko hikiriza umulimo gokuzi kabafu Aba kristu hoku baragiru wa kukora Tuwesengaze mwono mkama ruhanga Anya kumeza evi ntubiona Atahi ya mkitebe kia bahikiri ile Omobili kumutahi waito no taitas Oo turuko vya kuzika Kandi mwoyo kwe Aguragire kwete lane na bahikiri ile Omukujwe romusango Amugire mbabaze Nuku wa hazire kumuchuna, nuku munga njira, ama banja kebibibie, amuga ukangalize munawe, kanda mute umikono, ya muliso murungi, nuku asemerewe debilo biona, hamo na bahikirire, na alora mukama atakuwa ho.
Mama Abenai Nyoe. Namu kisa kwa rohango msuluzo viona isitwe na mwana na mwe mwikiri kwa sirimika huka ndi kubali inde. Misa ehoire mwikare omofisinge wa kristo. Masaba te romonga ro Reverend Father, abo amise gyo e ibarugam. We bade mono Father, abo ebika mbe bituhulire e virongi. Kandi tu ikirize bika mbe tu behondere. Mo nyikirize amu wangu manira bantuano. Abata kanyue na bikiyo hakino niyongera batangi na mo bade kuija. Batangi re. Antu awanya kuru kire biyebeka Bebe mbe ilwe omkai kuru nye wazazi Mujine zara nyoti na mbaze ibara Yonka mwebale kuija Mikira mbe kia akasatu Ntibu mbalini iso baba komitana Na Minister of Finance Na vati wona wakungu wa amani Baba ilewa nyorohan Mkusabwa kugarure sento muka Nchio nje chukusemba ya mkira mwebale mwebale Panyete Kwa Kwa Mgezo wangu wewe muri, mgeende haba uto wondi halifu, yewe muri. Ni amani yaro muri, ni amani yewe, yewe kari report. Anu woha hadi woha hadi wao, yewe kama asim. Thank you, my kwamba si. Ni amani asim kwa ya skapastis. Welcome you this day as we are celebrating the life of our dear friend, Uncle Tyrus Kajira, whom God called to join him. Now at this juncture, we're going to lay our wreaths we brought on the casket. We are going to use limited time. If I call you, please mind about the time as you're coming. Uh, we are going to start with the widow. The widow will be followed by the children. I'm still passing through the rest. The widow, the children, parents from Golo, parents from Seguku. Siblings, permanent secretary, strong permanent of the treasury, uh, will, be, will be represented by Rama. Sorry, will be represented by Mr. Ramadan Gobi. If he's around, uh, infrastructure and social development director budget, Mr. Rabani Bramko. 
Minister of Agriculture, Minister of Works and Transport, Kajan Secondary School Progressive. Okay. Now the lady, the widow, is saying a reason. That's why it's casket. May the Lord strengthen you. Now the children. After the children, parents from Guru, please be prepared. Meanwhile, parents from Sirko, also. Yeah. Those are the children of the Lord. God be with you, children of the Lord. Parents from Guru, please survive. The love of God, the love of a parent, I can't compare it to any. Both of the children. Now, parents from Guru. Meanwhile, as parents from Sibuko, so be prepared. Blessing of their son, their friend, their uncle, their brother. Goodbye, Titus. Parents from Sibuko. Thank you, sir, for coming. Yes. I think it's Mr. Rubber that will go with him. <laughs> yeah, he's represented by Mr. Rabban Bramko. I don't know why the ministry is laughing, but it's okay. Uh, infrastructure and social development. I uh, went there, Mr. Rabban Bramko. Uh, Minister of what? Minister of, Minister of Agriculture. Minister of Agriculture, a representative. Infrastructure and Future Services for Mate Department. Where oh, yeah, data so sorry. Okay, sorry. Those are the colleagues of a foreign brother. Now, this is Minister of Agriculture. That will be followed by Minister of Works. Transport. Minister of what? Transport a representative. If it's not there, against progressive, they have a risk.
against progress it will be followed by centenary courage to vote. Centenary's college to vote get prepared as friends of charity. Thank you. 
Silver Academy. Silver Academy. Of Tanaro. Kimako, can you please step forward? Kimako, Kimako, after Kimako, my younger Mr. Song, Mr. Kate, Kate Lamaro, Mrs. Kate Lamaro, Commanding Secretary, Education and Sports. Am I right? Mrs. Kate Lamaro, Commanding Secretary, Education and Sports. All take, all bows. All sick, all girls, they have a risk. Friends of talent. As pride microfinance.
Parents from Chengeju. Parents from Chengeju. At this time, we are heading to our switches, but we kindly request you, dear members, dear mourners, think about where you come from. Think about where you're from. Your friend whom you don't know where you came from. So, she do it as the time that we are so that we can make time as we as we say we will find it. We have, you know, we have, we know, we have very much to say about this function, but please, please, and they want to get time. Palawa has to also love their speeches. Thank you very much. I can see. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Executive Director, Public Procurement and Disposal as PPDA, Executive Director. Wave at the people. Thank you, you are welcome. Now, the Jamunyoro, now to the Center of Garula. Kwenda kusima na kumanyira abako Minyue na batu haire na batu wa haire Kikuija kukuma hamnaike The chairman organizing committee Please come and have your two minutes And then we proceed Kulimutu wena kubaza tusavire Ako zese taki kaiwiri uvalesi Kwa tusavale kumara yo Kukutungo utuhaiwe hano Kandi tukende hakini Thank you very much, MC. Uh, my name is Michael Zoreko, a friend to Titus, a best man to Titus, former workmate of Titus. Uh, I know a lot will be said about Titus, but allow me to say only one thing. Uh, Titus was a very, very generous person. And I want to give an example. One time he was very, very sick. And a world was very, very sick. A world was the mother. And the Imadu did not have the money as well. But let us had some money. Titus offered to pay the medical bills of our world and postponed his own treatment. I think that level of generosity is unmatched. Uh, as chairman of organizing committee, I want to thank Abantu uh, Bachamukweli. Last night, Abantu Bonabav Dewo. Abaku Nyo Lumbe. Abachamukweli, Mueva Lemuno. Abaku Vileko Mungalo. Uh, I want to thank everybody who is here for making time to be here. I want to thank the following people. One, Brenda, please stand up. I know nobody, please come at the front. There's nobody who has said thank you. But there are also those specific friends, the inner circle, including Mr. Malay and the rest. I want to thank you so much. Uh, well, when Tata told us that he was sick, tell why is it? We raised the money to support Titus. Thank you very much. But finance was a different ministry to what it is now. You've for the human resources. That is excellent. Please, 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 please. They are clapping themselves, but you should clap for them. These people have moved from step to step to ensure they look after their human resources in a very good way. You've financed Kajula's treatment. Let me tell you, those of you here who are not lucky, if you caught cancer, just thank to God, because there's no way. The amount of money that has been spent on Kajula is unbelievable. Financed to make that cost, I don't, I'm still in, I'm still in, I don't know, shock. I can't believe it. It is unimaginable. 
that you can spend money of that magnitude to look after. I feel I was not a very senior staff, I must say. For one reason or the other. One, sickness, of course, crippled his chances of going up. He should have been. By the way, God, the best, and kept on telling me, I've received the best in the world. So, Kajura has gone a happy man because of Minister of Finance. I want to thank you. <laughs> Lastly, Mr. Minister, hang on, I'm the chairman. Uh, I want to turn to our wife, Irene. Irene Barbara. Nanjeko, Kajura. When we met Irene, it was in 2000, some of us. They had met with Kajura in 1998. Irene was a little girl, beautiful and very little, very small. I didn't Hello, uh, I thought Irene would run. One time I called her and I asked her, don't you think that infection is contagious? And she told him, yes, it is. He said, how are you managing? She said, whenever I see a pimple or anything foreign on my body, I take medical checks. But she opened up a little bit and she said, Monangi. Wow, you know Kajura's skin, is, she said, was 95% bare. What it means? If you have seen someone has been burnt by hot water, that was Kajura's skin from head to toe. But she told me, Munang, even before she went, we went to intensive care for the last five weeks. They used to share a bed. In that skin, Irene would share a bed with her husband. That was a revelation to me. With a bare skin, she would share a bed, and she told me. Sagala Kumuisa will be Sagala will out of place. I'm very rejected. I want to be with him, even in bed, even when he's in that state. I know a few of us would handle such a situation. And even before that, when Kajula had that skin infection right at home, those of you who went there, Kajula would scratch his body from head to toe. And the house the house would be full of I don't know. But you know what happens when you smash your body. And you are flying everywhere. You tell me that in the morning you find the full heap of dry skin. To me, that was un unbearable. But the family in general was bearable. They did not run away from their home. They were can they were can assert us. Friends would go there and would share, would share from the same plate with Titus because there was no one to deject him. So, Irene and family, thank you so much. May God bless you. But before I hang up, as a best man, Irene, I need to say the following. First, we have kids to take care of. And please, all are your kids, and I want you to support them. While making decisions, Irene, please think twice. One for you, and two for Titus. That is the price I mean. Please think twice and make informed decisions. Secondly, you have several friends. You have to see which friends matter. If they don't matter, please dish them out. Stay with those friends who matter to you in this time. We hope and we are very willing to support you as friends of Titus and we shall support you as long as you want us to support you. We are ready to support, work with you. Whatever comes here, we shall fight your battles if you need to fight battles. We are with you. With those remarks, I want to again, once again, welcome you here and thank you for coming to send off Titus and wish you I could get it back home. Thank you.
person saying that, that, please come and give your mask. I'm told I should not tamper with the chair person. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I said, uh, okay, Saint Estate chairperson. I'm told the chairperson wants to get up as a chairperson one. One, one and a half minutes, Kansaleko. Yeah. Allow me to call the team. Huh? It's big, but I will request only those that are seated in front. Eh? Please come quickly. We have uh, one and a half minutes. Okay. As, as they are coming, Abikazi wona ba chamugwere ni baramsa muivalo kuija muhuinge. Abu akuba chingumbanya. Runyoro Kurungi, ni mbasava mbaze umurujungu. So, to the Minister of Health Family, so, sorry, sorry, I, I'm more attached to the Minister of Health. <laughs> to the Minister of Finance, really, really, you have done an amazing job. Please kindly clap yourself and everybody joins you. Really, you are an environment to work for. And I wish there is a space. HR, please put me in. Please, you have done a lot, a lot, a lot. You did it silently, but whenever you do something good, it will always burst out. Okay? So, the messages have been coming that you are cooking, you have been cooking something so good. Thank you so, so much, and may God bless you. And thank you, thank you for loving Titus. You know, it's rare to have a team that is committed to support and also travel all these big distance. Please, may God reward you. To the people of... Uh, I'm great still. I thank you for coming in big numbers and also loving your uh, fellow resident. That has been rare in the place and also uh, taking care of whatever is needed. Please, thank you so much. Um, I want also to spend a second to thank the widow for being there with eh, the late Titus. I know it's a lot to talk about that. Eh? Because we used to chat, I used to uh, reach here and like, I said it's rare for somebody to uh, stay with somebody in such a, a situation after the last minute. Thank you, thank you for implementing your voice. Thank you so much. Um, before I continue, I wanted to introduce myself and the team here. I'm George Wilson Chigose. We stay in Saints Estate. It's a, a, an estate of believers. And not, not only that, we are one family. The message that I always carry, if there is anybody here who lives in, a, in an estate and you have not yet considered yourself as a family, please start it from today. For us, I've always said this, that what happens to a member, we have attacked the whole family. And we are always, therefore, a member. So Titus has been a very good member, committed to anything that we are pushing. And we have liked him for so many things. He, he has been generous, he has been supportive. If it's a discussion, he will not fear anything, he will put it forward. I know I have a lot to talk about Titus, but uh, MC cheated me and gave me one and a half a minute. Eh? I wanted to summarize, but uh, otherwise I would need a whole day to talk about Titus. Uh, may God bless you and have journey mercies. MC, I wanted to hand over the authority back to you. I said we are going to stay here for the next four days. So please, that is day one now. 
then we are going to have day two <coughs> like that and it is there for thank you very much chairman saints of yes. believers yes one one last uh, thing i wanted also to thank to, to thank the community the, uh, the saints estate community just like all other people did they collected some condolences that were passed to the, the, the family so thank you i wanted to take it's important to thank that community. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, uh, Chairperson. And uh, now, uh, Kajansi uh, Community, Kajansi Progressive Senior Secondary School Community, please, another one and a half minutes. The other one were chairpersons, but if you are not a chairperson, uh, I don't know. God bless you. You're, you're science teachers. I'm told that you're science teachers. Okay, maybe now one minute. Science teachers summarize fast. Thank you. Clergy, uh, fellow mourners, uh, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, God is good, and all the time. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Musitwa Abduna, and I'm here speaking for and on behalf of the team from Kajans Progressive Senior Secondary School. Ladies and gentlemen, today is a very special and disturbing moment. When we are here witnessing the sending of, of our fallen comrade, our son, our grandson, Mr. Padura Titus. It is so trying because every time we look around, our memories are still disturbed because we are not really sure at some point whether indeed we are bidding farewell to our fallen friend. You know, at a moment like this, it is customary in our respective cultures in Africa and all over the world. And that's what also God recommends. That we need to remember our fallen friends with the special attributes, with the good things that they have left behind. For us as Kajian's progressive family, Ajura Titus has been remarkable for a number of attributes. One, <coughs> Sancho joined us, I think, when he was in his second year at Macquarie University. That time, he looked pretty young. And I remember our head teacher, who also was the director then, kept on asking him whether he would be in position to teach effectively. And like most of us know, uh, Mr. Kajura, was a man of his words. So the first time he came, he spoke a lot. And then eventually, he was able to win the heart of the director of the school. So from the second year, this young man began to teach. And he was teaching economics. I can share with you why we feel so touched by the demise of our fallen friend. One, Ajura Titus, we celebrate him for having been a hardly forgettable teacher. Sancho was teaching economics, but I tell you, from the moment he stepped in Kajian's progressive, things began to change significantly. In economics, 
I think we had, by the time he joined, acquired about three A's. And he said, from this moment, I must make a turning point. Those of us who know history. So his first year, we received 19 A's. And that was the beginning of things. Then when he went into year two, we received, I remember, we have a record. They were 43 A's. We are speaking about quality education. From that moment, Sancho changed from a mere Kajura. And our family branded him with the special title of the Lord. From that moment, he became Lord Sancho. Number two, in the interest of time, Kajura Titus was a man of action. Young as he was, he used to engage our boss. You know, we had a problem every time on Mkuru Yakoba, the rest of us would follow. Kajura Sancho Titus, the Lord, eventually acquired himself another title, the orator. He used to engage the boss. And on so many things, once Kajura stood, we always knew that was already passed. We would remember Kajura for the epoch-making changes in our school. In fact, in hardly two years, he had already been elevated to a deputy head teacher of academics. That was the moment I also joined. Let me remove my mask and you see me. At that time, economics was the best done subject. I also joined on board. I said, history must take the precedent. <laughs> so we used to fight with the Kajura. Now I'm bringing the third attribute, hard working. Kajura, once he entered a class, he refused to leave. He refused to leave class. So three teachers would come and assemble here at the doorway. We said, sir, leave. Sancho said, I'm a lord. I can't leave class. Luanga, I don't know why you have stayed. He was for geography, I was for history. So I used to bring a team. I said, Sancho, I made him kibina mjemu nyaka. And then he would tell them, you see, you remember how he used to speak, shaking a little bit like this. He said, as long as economics, the rest. <laughs> this was teaching geography. I was in, teaching history, and I was teaching economics. So we used to compete. And I can tell you during those years, the Jans progressive, short, I don't know whether that's the right word, tremendous improvement and performance, and it was now ranked among the Jans schools, not only in Kampala, but but in the rest of the country as a whole. We can't live before we recognize Sancho's charisma. Sancho was a very inspirational man. I tell you, you know, when he started to teach, people used to hate economics because we were it under a lot of historical terms and students admired our terminologies. So Sancho na ina iye bibi mungiriye. So whenever he got anyone who had scored above 45, he would tell him, you're a junior lord. Mare is here. I don't know whether. That lord you see there, that is now a very rich man. He's a host. So he said, you are junior lord Mare. Then I'll, there is also another one I've not seen, Irumba, and several others. There is this one, Sekamati, is a deputy head teacher. That stomach you see there. Yeah. But the good thing, this one is doing arts. So, Sancho, they are inspiring the young generations. I can tell you, if you want to have success in life, there is no shortcut other than passing economics first, of course, and then other subjects. The story is long. When eventually, Minister of Finance, Director of Yamusavanamga, please, should you leave this school as it is today? We're going to have a problem. So, gradually, 
We are not reporting the, 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 the deceased people. But he used to spare his weekends with us. So, Sancho, Yagamba Abana by economics. This is not the end. We can serve Kajan's progressive in one capacity and also in other capacities in that regard. Era Abana, Kumaya Bagadisa, Yaba Kuara, Nebakora's interviews, and I think Mare, Yumba, and several others are working with different banks, including Bank of Uganda. Those are the people. As I wind in my remarks, we want in a special way to express our utmost gratitude to the God. To inner have reason to celebrate the life of our fallen comrades. I will so we want to thank God for his life. He has been there. He's amongst that have been blessed with a very beautiful family. We have seen the wife and the children and the rest of us. We must be thankful to God. I want to tell you that the wife you have seen, beautiful as she is, she's also a member of our family, Kajian's Progressive. And especially we want to thank the Minister of Finance, if you have a good day, it will be a good speaking. We can't go without expressing our gratitude to the friends. Wherever you are, we acknowledge the great contribution you have made towards uh, the medical bills and recovery of the life of the fallen comrade. Thank you so much. May God bless you. I want to end by thanking the rest of the members of this community, whoever is here for a reason or the other, you deserve a reward from God for everything that you have done for San Joe and the family. I want to make an appeal, ladies and gentlemen. Sir, like, you know, the name of Soko Kuzara, so my youngest girl is now in senior four. The rest are grown up. Some of them are almost my age. But family progressive. We are going to do all it takes to make sure that this family succeeds in life. And in a special way, to get up to my new so, in one of the divine scriptures, you know, I'm a Muslim, I'm a Haji. 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 And I accept we slept here, so there is a reason why we are here. Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, when a person dies, his record of account gets closed, other than three things. And I would like to end my remarks on this. But he says, when he dies, there is a spring of rewards that continue flowering from the good children. Okuzo mwano mununji, mwano mkuru wange wakuzizaba na balunji. Those who become godly and always remember and pray for their fallen father, God will always have a reason to remember him. And that contributes to his well-being in the eternal peace. Number two, God talks about the flowering knowledge he has showed unto the generations. Lord Sancho, we believe he has done this. As we see, we are serving this country and the entire world at large. For every good, for every good thing each of them does, we believe. There is always a contribution in terms of reward that goes to Sancho. And the last, but by no means the least, Katonda, Yarika Wekubo, Ilias Sadaka, Petujita Sadaka, but in English, what is Sadaka? 
sacrifice. Sancho abadde muna dini, ebintu ngane unyisa zengani haji nga yeye ita bishop, you know? Inanga rosary te mufawa. It is incumbent upon everyone here, and I will request our humble, uh, humbly our clergy, if possible, this man of God needs to have the sacrifice remain living for the rest of the life. If it is there is a church, we can make a contribution so that this man continues enjoying the blessings of the divine nature. <laughs> was an ancient Greek um, uh, philosopher. If you go to it, but he said in one of his words that there is only one way to happiness, and that is ceasing to worry about anything that is beyond the power of our individual will. There is only one way to happiness, and that is ceasing or stopping to worry about things beyond our control. Sancho, in his entire life, about that in a plan, yari kaya muyoka ngatia president ya tiyeti fujogo president. But the rest of the things he always dreamt and said, one day I'll become so and so. Now is no more. What is my message? Sancho about the generous. For that one you said. Sancho about the poor said. Sancho was a woman what? Taina kiere kira yo. But this Sancho, if it was a moment to express happiness, he was always there. Full God. There is always time for everything. May I pray to the Almighty Lord that brought us here peacefully to take us back to our respective homes peacefully. In the mighty name I pray. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Agassi. We want to thank you for an elaborate uh, art subject. We only remember that economics is a science subject. So, uh, may I call upon Kirise, Ntangire, Okumwa, Okuruka, Unguruse, Seguku, Nahabweki, Obuse, Daro, Wam. The family of the late Sancho the family of Irene. I'm standing in for. I'm called someone of a teacher of art, but I'm going. So transmitter is not very okay. Let me extend. I'm sent here by the parents and family. Of Seguku and Tebe and the wound, Chama Mukaka in Masaka. All has been said about Sancho, and I'm not going to repeat whatever has been said. Mzei Chazze, who is there with the, uh, the, he, uh, his elder brother, Mzei Kseni, and the rest of the family, they are here. They thank everyone for. The contributions, the friendship, love that you have shown to all of us. In some finance, there are some of you have already seen before. I used to come there when I had, I had just completed my university. I was a young man. Sancho called me. He was starting his house in Chitetika. He told me, stay on that. Thank you.
kumwa kwa kurugire a a mwazaye a seguko can we have Miriam Rwanda Miriam Rwanda with your Imako children two minutes Meanwhile, as she comes, can we have Miriam Mwizuche, the Marcos, the other one, are preparing themselves. This one is Miriam Rwanda with the Gima, for the Gimako children. Since I'm not a chairperson, I need to be short. Um, Ecclesiastes chapter 3 verses 1 to 8 talks about a time for everything. There was a time Daddy Michelle was here with us and now is a time that he's not. But let's not forget we're here to celebrate our life we live. Um, there's a very big difference between living life and living a life of significance. Daddy Michelle lived a life of significance. A life of significance is one where you impact each and every one that you meet. All of us are gathered here today because he touched us in very different ways and we're all here to celebrate him. I mean, you can all attest the past week so many people have been coming in. I don't know so many people who know a number of people. Um, Daddy Michelle was a disciplinarian and a very great mentor. Every time he would come to Gaza for BD, before you eat that food, you show him the report. It's not great, you see the teachers. Even after seeing the teachers, you do corrections, then you eat the food and the grab. Um, he was a very strong-willed person. The strong will has enabled him to add 10 more years to his life because he fought a very, very good fight. And lastly, we all know he was an economist. He knew how, things, how tough things are. There's no time you'd find Daddy Michel and he doesn't give you some company. He was a very, very generous man. And may God bless him and continue to bless him through his family. We deeply appreciate everyone who has been able to take care of him. May his soul rest in peace. Thank you. Thank you very much, Kimako uh, children who are doing sciences. And we have uh, Miriam Mwishuche with the Kimakos. Hey, another scientist is coming. Thank you very much. Jimako Agnes. So Jimako means um, G for Grace, I for Irene, C for Christine, who is not here, M is Miriam, and O is Olivia. We are the wives of the Jimako men. Um, ladies and gentlemen, allow us to join you to celebrate a symbol of love. Titus was tall, he was handsome and smart. Irene, you're very lucky. You met a good thing. Through Titus, we were loved. We call it osmosis love. Titus used to call Irene baby. Every time they organized something, if you notice, we have children who are in the same age bracket, would go back home and get pregnant. <laughs> would really don't want to cry for Titus. In his goodness and in his life, we went to places. I know wherever he's sleeping, he's smiling. I'm not sure he's smiling for Olivia because she didn't put on her dress. But I'm sure he's happy that he, we put on the dresses that he got for us. And it's very exciting to celebrate someone who has written a beautiful book. Titus's book is complete with beautiful chapters. He has a beautiful story. To you, Irene, our friend, it's up to you. He married Jane Church, gave you the best Many years ago, Irene used to drive an email. What else do you want, Irene? <laughs> the 
They took you to church and wedded you. We accompany you to church. Grace is her matron. It's up to you. If you choose to cry every day, you're finished. Hold your husband's image high. Much as we are short, we must walk in the image of a tall man. Amen. Titus was a lover of class. Sometimes he encouraged our husbands to take us to places, to just sleep. We would sleep and grow fatter. We've just lost weight. <laughs> we'd eat chips and chicken and pork. I don't know, I recognize you, Mr. Mwishe, my husband, stand up. Sometimes I think, I, I don't know whether darling has this money. Stand up, Mr. Male, wherever you are. Mr. Male is Olivia's husband. Mr. Male, stand up. Mr. Ko is Christine's husband, please stand up. And Mr. Mayanda is Grace's husband, please stand up. Now, among us, them, we will just find them with money. Mr. Sozi, where is he? Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> there is Mr. Sozi. We don't know where they got the money from, but there are also times when they arranged with priests for us to recite our vows. So we would go thinking we are going to sleep, and they would call us forward to swear again. <laughs> and they would expect us to look at them in the eye. And we did these things several times, but also to affirm our principle on marriage and love our principle on marriage and love. And that's where our foundation, Irene, is built. I want to caution the children of Jimapo, most especially Michelle. Michelle, stand up. Michelle, if you have been loved, you got your share. Keep standing. You must pass on that share to your siblings in all quantities. Life is a journey, and this is our portion. We must celebrate it. Thank you, Michelle. Lastly, allow us to say, a huge voice has left us. A huge laughter. A real laughter. When Sancho laughed, you'd have to laugh. I had never seen Sancho angry. Miriam, when he came to Gaza, he had a reason why he'd get angry. Sancho was a happy man. Sancho often told us about the When sometimes it's the meal we had, he had values. Lastly, I'm not a mourner. Olivia doesn't like to mourn. Aki doesn't like to mourn. Grace is a pastor. Irene, listen, <laughs> we are not going to cry. As you may know me, I'm a cheerleader. I'll go on Facebook and write about this funeral. You know it. I'm not going to come to you every day because I'm busy. But you know in the background, I am there and I'm available. I'll buy you the earrings and the lipstick. I'll also come to counsel your children. I definitely know Olivia will send you money. <laughs> I know which she'll send you money for a trip to Dubai. What I'm really sure of, Grace is going to pray and fast. She's going to pray and fast. And I know wherever Christine will be, she's going to get you that pair of shoes. I also know Aggie will do this. Irene, once is a So with that, you have a package of a support system that is going to support you at probably 100%. And to you, my fellow mourners, especially the children, we are not your relatives. We are your father's friends. It's very, very important today that you build the best social networks. Don't be bogus and go into drugs. Don't go into early pregnancies. Do not bring us men or women who don't know God. <laughs> also, don't bring very broke ones, eh? <laughs> Because <laughs> we've really given you the best. And with all that, once again, I'd like to thank you very much for honoring us and for coming to Martini to Barry Sancho. I don't know if the MC is not stopping me, but I'm done. Thank you. Thank you very much, Dimagos. Uh,
And, uh, okay, I know the, the Banyoro men who are here are very rich, and they have produced the rich children who will extend that legacy. Thank you very much. In the interest of time, can I ask um, Professor Obua, Chairman Board Naro, can you come and deliver your message? Thank you so much, MC, the widow, bereaved children, relatives, all mourners in your respective capacities. Ladies and gentlemen, I speak here on behalf of the NARO fraternity. NARO is an acronym for National Agricultural Research Organization. I'm here with my team, members of the Governing Council, on which Titus Kagura served, and representation of the management of NARO. We are indeed saddened and felt the pain and tragic loss of our brother Titus Kagura. Titus served for two terms as a member of the Governing Council of the National Agricultural Research Organization. NARO is governed by a council, not a board as such. That's the title we have. And so we are here to be part of the family and all mourners to celebrate the life of Titus Kadiora. And because of that, we just want to say, to God be the glory. Titus was extremely valuable to us as a member of the Governing Council of NARO. He was very productive, technically gifted. He represented the permanent secretary of the Minister of Finance on the Governing Council. He gave us the kind of strategic direction we needed in terms of economic advice, in terms of financial planning, and our budgeting system. And we never went wrong. Being a representation, a representative of the Ministry for Finance through the PS office, he sometimes gave us the inside information. <laughs> Finance people, don't, don't, don't take it back which was extremely useful to us. And because of that, Titus helped us to see growth in our MTEF, the budget. Unfortunately, he could not finish the second term, which we are now finishing. But we are happy to say that because of his inputs, guidance, and participation, our budget even when others are budgeting at zero increase, we have significantly had increase in the budget of NARO. We are scientists, so we keep brief. We will not go so long with the remarks, but we want to wish the family that has been bereaved, may God bless you, and to everyone else, we also want to say God bless you. We've already made our contribution, a humble contribution. We don't want to mention how much, but we hope that we will keep Titus family in our minds, even when he's no longer a member of the governing board. I mean, governing board. God bless you all, colleagues. Thank you so much. Thank you, Naro. Those are scientists, and we invite the other scientists in the name of Minister of Finance. Please come and make your presentation. Our Minister of Finance, our Minister Uh, 
from known as the nearest exit capacity. I take this opportunity to thank you for joining all of us at this occasion to celebrate the life of our fallen brother, son, friend, Titus Agura. Uh, my name is Laban Mbramuko. I sat in here for the permanent secretary and secretary treasury, Mr. Ramadan Kobi, who was unable to make it to this place, but is with you in spirit. And he has given me a condolence message to deliver. Much of the things that he had put down have already been said. So, uh, according to my OB here, much as I'm a historian, I will try to be a scientist. <laughs> so, uh, the family of the late Titus. Sorry, before I do that, I want to recognize the permanent secretary, Minister of Education and Sports, who has made it to this place. We thank you for leaving your visit schedule and joining the rest of us at this occasion. The statement of the Foreign Secretary reads as follows. The family of the late Titus Kajura and the fellow mourners, on behalf of the Minister of Finance, Planning and Economic Development, and on my behalf, I wish to extend our sincere and heartfelt condolence to you over the loss of Titus. We are the Minister of Finance, Planning and Economic Development land with profound sadness of the death of Mr. Titus Kajura, which occurred on Wednesday, 1st June 2022. His career history with us is that he joined the public service on 11th May 2000 as an economist finance officer, and in the the deployment was posted to the Minister of Finance, Planning and Economic Development. We want a community card as well, much as we recruit economists and finance officers, we also deploy them in other ministries and departments. It was confirmed in the public service as an economist in 2002, and owing to his excellent performance, was promoted to the post of the economist in 2008, post he held until the time of his death. I would say, just remaining from this, I survived Kajura from the day he joined the ministry. So, Uncle, where are you? In fact, the other person who joined with him is uh, Juliet Tokuhaire and Angela Rabutomize Masi. Are the ones I can remember. So I've seen them since they joined the ministry and to where they are today. It was not for the sickness, as the earlier stated, I think Kajura would also be at the uh, have died or would have gained a higher position than where he was. As an officer, he contributed much to the government of Uganda public expenditure as the technical officer for agriculture, animal industry and fisheries, ministries of works and transport, information, communication and the information, information, communication technology, was responsible for overseeing the preparation of technical policies, budgets, project population and monitoring of a wide range of government policies in those areas. We also contributed to the local government business through what we do. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes. So I was saying he also contributed to the local government fraternity through the budget consultation that we undertake annually. He also appraised the projects for inclusion in the public investment plan. 
He also contributed to committee discussions, parliamentary committee discussions during the approval process of the budget framework papers and the budget. And he also represented the ministry on various boards. One of them has, and councils, one of which has just attested to that. Senior officer, he also coached and he mentored the young officer that joined us in the ministry and more also in the Department of Infrastructure and Social Services as well as budget policy and evaluation. And he also ensured that our staff performed according to the standards. I believe the family will give us a history of his medical treatment. But as a Minister of Finance, we tried our best. But uh, as it is said, what God has prepared for you, nobody else can take it away. That was the plan of God. We saw through Titus from 1971 to June 1st, 202. Wait, sorry, to, to, to 2022 when he left us. Uh, I believe the family will give us a detailed uh, history. So in conclusion, for us at the Minister of Finance, Titus will be remembered for his intelligence, hard work, professionalism, humility, and friendship. We commiserate with you during this time of sorrow and pledge our love, friendship, and support during the trying moment. And we pray that the Almighty God comforts you during this difficult time. May his soul rest in eternal peace. But before I hand over the microphone, I'm requesting the finance fraternity to stand up for recognition. Yes, uh, can you see them? Yes. That's the finance fraternity. And indeed, even the sister, Immaculate, is part of the finance fraternity. We thank you, and we will continue to pray that uh, God gives the family the courage and wisdom to continue with life where Titus has left them. Thank you. Secretary Minister of Finance, what I've also picked is saying that you give us the chronology that is asking for accountability. So I've noted that one, I'll give you the accountability in detail. Thank you very much. Uh, may we now invite the siblings. Uh, Immaculate, please come here and you mobilize your siblings to make your remarks. And in the interest of time, this is what will happen. When I return the microphone to the priest, we will ask the clergy, we will have the choir, we will have people distant for a private funeral. They are the ones who will go down there. You and me will remain here in our seats. Then when they come back, when it is finished, we can also view the area. Thank you. Thank you, Kenzie. Thank you, Kenzie. Brother Nicholas, who leads us in the Sasano, and the visiting father, I'm sorry, I didn't get to your name in time, Father Paul. The directors, commissioners, I'm sorry, PS. I'm sorry, I should have started with PS. It's because she's my personal friend. I call her Katie, so kindly forgive me. In such a forum, I should give you your due respect. Present my boss. Mr. All 
stated in Paris, the ED of the ED of PPDA. I'm glad that you came. He was my former boss. At the time, he was my manager when I was in PPDA. But because we had that working relationship, and he is also from Masindi to a certain extent, I'm glad that you made it here. Uh, all protocol observed. Uh, uh, permit me to request my children to make a small speech. I personally, I eulogized my brother yesterday in church. I'm not going to give a, a speech in a form on a, on a form of talking about what he has done. I'm going to give Titus his other siblings to talk about him because they have witnessed his goodness as well. But permit me to ask Alison and Adrian to say a word. Thereafter, the siblings will talk, then I will talk about the future. I'm not going to talk about the past. Like, 
was a magician and he also told us how he had a trophy in dancing and what not. And he used to dance for us there back the day that he had the trophy there somewhere. Like, so it was very good. Like, his jokes were nice. He's, you realize, like, when you grow up, like, now you have stories to tell your friends what not about your uncle, the fun things he used to do. And I'm very grateful for that. And I'm grateful that he was part of my life. He still is. And everything happens for a reason, and we trust in God, and we are more than conquerors to do who love us. The clergy who fed us with what I'm calling spiritual food. Always when people eat food, they forget to say thank you. Then we say thank you for the spiritual food you gave us. I am Kenyera John Bosco, a brother the late Titus. I come from Guru, where the father, the late father, the one was already made. I have not come alone. We have other brothers, sisters, uncles, colleagues. I would request them maybe to rise up from where you are. Those from Guru, now lawyer. There they are, including the clan chief. We are here up to about three or four days to share because we have been missing a lot. If I'm to put the death of the late Titans in kind of examination, Maybe write a good thing and a bad thing about 
To me, it will be that the good thing is what you're seeing now. Many, as we mentioned, many as from various areas have shared with many I didn't know those are the good things about death. If you had not died, all of you would not come here. All very few would come. But because of his death, we are able to share many things now. That's an encouragement for death. Then maybe the part of death is that the day that has, is gone and gone from you. If only you could go and come back, what would make you do a difference? But it's gone from you. It's too bad there. So that is that. Uh, I cannot go without mentioning also a few attributes of the late writers who mentally the family he had been a different person. When you go to visit, he comes in a different uh, way. His major task was on education. And since he raised a few of us, including myself, and I graduated, he picked a few of us from deep in the village and carried me. Right now, we are about five who graduated from his hand. And I have a life testimony. One is here. I will make a good talk. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Tony Amena. I'm Peter's younger sister. A lot has been said about my brother. Indeed, I don't regret anything. I had the best brother ever. Peter was really generous. Peter took me like his own. And I remember when Taita took me to, uh, to send me to Kajan School Westage by then. He told me, send me, you're going to join Kajan School Westage, but no your name will change from Anena to Semi Sanjo. And that's how I was told. He told me, be a good girl, and I want you to perform. Put at the back of your mind that economics is in your family. So nothing like coming with a BC or that word. It was really difficult. I had to, whenever we would underperform, I would cry, fearing that the mutual and the mutual that would follow. So that one inspired me. I worked so hard, and I scored an A in economics because of my brother. <laughs> my brother extended his hand to so many people in my family. He prolonged the life of my father, because back at home, we don't come from really a good, that big family. But Titus tried. I saw when Titus picked some of us, life really changed. At least he touched. Even those ones who are not at school, first me, Titus supported indirectly or in the other way around. Titus was so good. And I remember when daddy was at the hospital, I would cry almost every day. Titus would call me on video and he would tell me, Sammy, you need to keep strong. I'm not there. I'm here at the hospital, but still, Titus would try. And I remember when my, my father was passing on last year, he was like, tell me, don't worry, you still have another father. And that father, Caritas, I feel bad. A lot has been said. I had the best brother ever. And on behalf of my siblings, I would like to request, I know somehow, maybe a fight has a wrong you, please, Forgive my brother. And on his behalf, Titus was forgiven you all. Titus was loving. Titus was my bear. I love you. And I can never leave your family. I am like this. Because of him, my mother was welcoming. They raised me. That's all I can say about my brother. Thank you so much, everyone, for coming. Then last, I forgot something. Please, this is home. I know after burial like this, school will go away. Please don't leave us. At least once in a while, come. We have a home here in Malibu. We have a home in Kampala. Please don't leave Mami Michelle. At least you come. The way you used to, come visit Adimito. Do the same too. 
Mami Michu and our kids. Thank you so much. Yeah, as I told you earlier, that is one. But we are many. To me also, he nurtures me in the economics, and I'm a teacher of economics. Uh, I don't only stop there, I will also extend. We only call her Mama Michu, because in our clan we are fond of calling uh, the, the women with the child, child, the child's name. Mama Michu really thanks a lot, together with the sister. Here. Really, we are crying for Titus, we are crying for Titus. But to me, I'm seeing it in a different way. Titus has been very close with this too. So his knowledge has not gone. To me, the knowledge has not gone. The knowledge is still remaining with the two. So long as you have used it properly, you will see continue with the knowledge that has left. You can either trace from her, trace from uh, this. Uh, Imagine it. So I'm very strong. We can still, when we're in problem, when we need to be some guidance and the rest, we can still come to the truth. And I have a hope that the way that people will come in us, they will still welcome us. And then life continues. With a few, I said, may the soul of fighters rise in eternal peace. Thank you. Thank you, Bosco. is going to do it. They asked me, what do you want us to do for you? They will be here. And my name is Abamunganye. I want to go for Hakiaru. Tichuicha. He was ailing and in great pain, but he wasn't worrying that, how am I going to pay the medical bills? It was not one of his worries. And when he passed on, I was by his bedside, 
and with I and his wife. So when they pronounced him dead, we went back to our apartment. <laughs> then we started making calls. We are now looking for a funeral home. So we had found one. You know, there's a time difference of 10 hours between Uganda and San Francisco. So it was in the evening. We had made an appointment to visit a funeral home at 9 a.m. the following day. Then uh, HR, Madam President Rangogo, called me and told me, Uganda Funeral Service is going to take over the repatriation of the body. It was a big relief. Because when you are in a foreign country, my dear, it's tough. And I want to tell you, I salute Irene. Irene was in California from February until he passed on. And remember, he is in the ICU and he is, she is alone in the apartment. And I would like to thank Uganda Funeral Services. Yes, there were some shortfalls. Things happened. There were some screaming here and there. Kindly forgive us. You should understand that we were grieving, we were up just it had taken a month, we needed a body back. We had drawn the program, it was not there. I can assure you, when they told me the body is not coming, having earlier confirmed that it was board, it was on board, I screamed. You should have been on the other side. Kindly forgive me for that. I want to thank. The Bible says, he who finds a good wife finds favor. Titus found favor in Irene. Irene was a good wife. Whatever the circumstances, she was. And she was there. She has lived to her vows of poverty, in poverty, in riches, and in sickness. But for her, it could have been more in sickness. Irene, Titus has run his race. He put up a good fight. We lost it, but he is in a better place. Irene, you have a big mantle before you. But remember, when I was living in the US, in the US I told you one word as you were crying. You were weeping and wailing. I told you, worry not. And that is that I can give back to my brother. Yesterday in church, I told you, had I died, had it been me who had passed on, he would do the same for me. So I am pledging my support to ensure that Titus' children go to school. I request each and every one present here to pray for me so that I can have the knowledge, the grace, and the wisdom, and also be forgiving because along the way we shall get up. And let's look at a bigger picture, not trivial things. With that, I may have forgotten to say something, or oh, I had forgotten to thank my friends. But you know, I hold you dearly. I don't have many friends, but all my friends, I hold them dear, and they have done a great job for me. Some of them met me at the airport, and immediately I came, they were at home. I have, I have one friend who was my driver during this trying moment. She put aside all that she was doing, and she offered to drive me. And most of them were asking me, what can I do for you? And I told them, the body hasn't come. We shall let you know. Without forgetting my workmates. Oh, that was going to be a big mistake. Can you please rise up? <coughs> Thank
thank you for being a family. When my brother was ill in hospital, he was very sick, I recall him. I broke down in a meeting, it was an online meeting. And I told them, pray for me, my brother is not well. They kept on praying. We have a reverend in the house. She prayed for me, she could come home and we pray. I thank you for that. I would like to thank my boss, who gave me time off. I was given a compassion leave. Like I said, I say, at the ministry, they lead from the heart. They are very compassionate. They understand that people have problems. Thank you so much. I'd like to thank Enid. I sit with Enid. She took on all my duties. When I, when I was traveling, I did hand over program because it was abrupt and we were, it, it was at the peak of the year. So she kept on calling me. I kept on guiding and you were able to cross the year successfully. So with that, like, let me end by saying, what I was doing biology, I think, which is a science, I'm a scientist, for that matter. And the answer would be maybe I for one, then two, then two and three, then four, then all the above. Whatever every speaker has mentioned here, I think they stole my speech. It should have been my speech. Um, may Titus so rest in eternal peace. And may perpetual light shine upon him. Thank you very much, the siblings. Excuse me a bit. Uh, I forgot to mention this. Uh, we came with a small contribution after hearing the death of uh, Titus. Others went digging, others went selling what they have. So we managed to make some contribution, which is with the, our elder brother. That one we handed over to uh, our mission. Thank you for that. Thank you, uh, thank you very much, the siblings. Thank you very much, the guru community, the parents, for the contribution that um, is coming. Uh, in the interest of time, we have the siblings, the children of the late Titus Ajura, not siblings, but the chief children, the siblings are just gone. Children, please make your way here and come and meet and speak to the mourners around. And uh, may I ask that you prepare the widow, because we are also going to hear from her immediately after the children. My colleagues say they are coming. Yes. These are condolence messages. Okay. I will not forget to pay when they send their condolence message to the family. Afra Sarada, head of head of Lady St. George BBC. Against progressive, you send your condolence messages. Uh, signed by St. Tongo Susan. Thank you very much. National Agriculture Research Organization, your message has reached. Please thank you very much with your enormous support. Please then go ahead with that. Yes, thank you. A daughter's first love is her father. And that was my dad to me. He really loved me, actually, I can tell you so. Um, he took care of me. Um, I do the combination math, because I'm geography. Even if my dad did not math, he would always sit me down and teach me. He would teach me. We would learn the county at like 12 a.m. He would always give me papers to do at home and mark them. And he would teach me geography. 
he was always there for my school events. And through my dad's sickness, um, he would always take his time to take us out, teach my siblings, attend my young sister's swimming galas or her swimming practice, just to be there. Um, my dad was really sick, as we all know. And me and my siblings, plus Brenda, plus my mom, his skin was falling off. Sometimes he'd be really uncomfortable. He would call us to help, like, scrape it off, or like smear him Vaseline, because he would really be feeling uncomfortable. But all through that pain, my dad would always tell us how much he loved us, and tell us how we'd be okay. And we kept strong in that period of time. say is I'm really grateful that I experienced my dad's life. My dad's period of time he was around and my siblings also experienced the love that he gave us in the time he was around. And I'd like to thank all the owners who came here from long distances for being here for us. Thank you. And thank you for honoring you know, My brother wants to say something. his restaurant and we get something to eat from there. We don't share with us that he brings back home. He would come and my brother Malcolm to share our fish with him. Every time when my school has an event, he would always be there. He never missed an event. On the concert day he was sick, but he still the game. Right now, when he felt sick, he still even took time to go with us places even if he was feeling pain. He never told any of us he was in pain. He was always smiling and showing his strong but laughing with us and he loved us continuously. Just last year, and about this year, he was about to my sister Miranda. Showing love for her, then I got jealous a little. <laughs> so I started sleeping on his stomach a lot. He was a very strong man. Thank you. Yes, thank you very much, the children. Please, many calls have come up, particularly for Manchester Finance. There are those with first class, there are those who are doing sciences, begin preparing the desk for them. As we invite the widow, Pablo, come and give us a contribution, a tribute in the form of a song, as we usher in the widow to come and address us. Thank you. Pablo. Yes, Haz is coming. Uh, management and staff of Prime Microfinance, your contribution. Thank you very much. Cotton Development Organization, thank you very much for your contribution. Uh, Mr. Jolly K. Sebunya, Mrs. Management Director, thank you very much. He forgot to speak. That he forgot to speak that he was going to get triple S. Oh, S give him a chance. First of all, I thank God for coming here. The times I can remember when my father used to work so that it's about Ronaldo and Miss. I preferred Ronaldo, but they used to say that Miss is better, all that stuff. He was a very loving man. He will surely be missed. I have my own way of thinking that that is not dead. That's how I think. 
So to me, that's justice at the body. But he's always in my heart. Always remember him. Pablo, Pablo, where are you? I, have you cancelled the, the tribute? Oh. The Lord is good all the time. Oh, I love you people because you love God. <laughs> I would love to appreciate everyone who has done for our brothers. Mona. Mm. I'm actually, I'm from a distance. I'm from Gulu. Uh, then I've decided to turn up for our brother. Uh, I want Actually, I want to tell people here to be with that confidence because God is still with us and everything will move on. Oh, and DJ, let's give some song.
Please. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. So anyone who wants a copy of this song can get it. Thank you very Thank much, you. Pablo. Pablo. Thank you very much for your tribute. And uh, uh, please, those who are preparing the uh, window. I also want to, I know the microphone was not clearly connected with the DJ is also near with the song. So I want to appreciate Ministry of Finance. Uh, you get your copy because I, the names of people cannot be, I cannot name them, I cannot sing them at once. And uh, the family, you can get the copy because the names are there, but I cannot now put them at once. I appreciate everyone who has done up so much. God gave you more and more. Thank you, Pablo. Uh, our microphone to get it out. Can we bring the microphone there? Please, can we have the microphone for the widow addressed on us? Mfakati Agenda Tubaliza Abugini Obsembayo Obwa Umgenziba Naweki Namgondezor Gendo Urungi Hari Abugendi. Thank you. parents, my in-laws, both from Gulu, Masindi, our aunts from Toro, friends, and other family members. Begin by thank you, thanking you all for all the support, the love you have shown us during this period. May God bless you. Go on and thank my sister in law. May I call her Mami Adrian? Thank you, thank you for always being there for us. You are really a good sister in law. have always supported us. You've loved me unconditionally. Thank you. Thank you very much. In Uganda, let me say, Tanso so de. Iratambo de. In that, she would entrust me maybe into every more. That in the Uganda way. But me, Atenga, Ndimuchala, Chala, the Baliba was his or was Thank you very much. Chizibu, 
okusanga a sister in law nata ku abaganda bagamba but that saying was by my nazara at one point that was around before we wedded she called me by then titus was not well off he didn't have enough money to support me and him but my mother in law was in a circle at colpi they had a women's group and by then i was still in my a level she would send for me pay for my transport and give me upkeep one day she told me nti there is a saying in buganda that says kusanga nazala u kusanga malalo but it's not always like that she told me as a family you're young we shall all love you and support you and indeed she did so my sister in law has done so and i know she will still love me and support me and my kids around 2010 i met taitafis family of gulu the dad came in from gulu visited us for some days then after we had to drive to gulu after some months and when we reached there they were really welcoming mama thank you very much for welcoming me to gulu i met most of all the family members back in gulu our late dad emmanuel omona introduced us to different siblings of titus we organized a, in 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 buganda we call it okumanyagana thank you very much for accepting us what they got wali to kuze I would like to thank the Ministry of Finance. Thank you very much for all the support. Titus has close friends in finance. Thank you, thank you very much. Mr. Mblamuko on behalf of Titus
I know you may wonder why. I have singled him out. Titus, during his last days, Tell me, Mr. Mblamoko has really supported me. Whenever Titus would ask for money, he would make sure he gets it very fast. He would sign. Thank you very much. Titus was grateful, really grateful to you. My brother, Roger. Thank you for loving my husband. Thank you very much. And th thank you for taking good care of my kids. And wherever we are away, we had two kids who are not in boarding. That's Miranda and Senata. Roger does not stay home. He has his own home. But he would make sure by six in the morning, he jumps on a border, comes home, picks up the kids. By 6.40, they're at school. In the evening, he would do so again. He would, Miranda, or is Miranda in the evening has swimming lessons on a daily basis. He would, he would make sure that Miranda goes for those trainings that she doesn't need. During hospital visits, sometimes I was down. He would drive tight us the medical visits. Thank you very much, Roger. Brenda, my young sister Brenda. And Brenda and Miranda. As young as she is, she needed a life, but Brenda has just completed university as they, she, she graduated a few days before Titus passed on. Brenda, because I used to come back fairly late from work, before Brenda would go to campus, she knew Titus loved Katogo. We had made that home, but it's Brenda who would prepare Titus's breakfast if it's not me. She would make sure she wakes up at around 4.45, prepares food, that we would have for breakfast, prepares the clothes we are going to put on, prepares the kids for school, before 
before she prepares also to go to campus for studies. Me, I'm in Sobuzi. There are times I would spend like a week, I'm not home, but I knew Brenda would always be there. If Titus needed to be smeared Vaseline or helped, let me say like bathing, since Brenda Yalita Mozilla, she would do the work and I would be comfortable and Titus was very comfortable with Brenda. Brenda, thank you very much. Miranda, I call her my miracle baby. Miranda is eight years. And Titus has been sick for more than around 11 years. But we managed. And it was a struggle. We got Miranda. We thank God for that. When we gave birth to Miranda, by the time I gave birth to Miranda, Titus was on his first round of chemo. I gave birth to this beautiful girl. She grew up when the dad is sick until when she reached of age. She's a white, white, patient baby. Oh. <coughs> when she was of age, when she was around two years, we left for India. We just told her we are going to India for treatment. We thought she was too young. We didn't tell her, we didn't elaborate more. By then, two years she had joined kindergarten. She went to the office, told the headmistress, yes, I know daddy and mommy are in India. She was around three years, but they didn't inform me of what daddy is suffering from. The school called. They told us your girl is complaining ABCD. We called home, talked to her, and she understood. Time came, we came back. After some years, the dad developed a skin problem. I have other kids who are older. But the reason why I'm thanking Miranda. When the dad explained to Miranda his condition, Miranda intensified on the care he was giving him. My husband's skin was peeling all the time. Miranda would ensure she sweeps. The dad has to be in a clean place. The dad needs to sleep in clean bed sheets. She knows how to lay a bed. She would change the bed sheets. At times, for the past two years, Miranda has been doing homes, homeschooling. So she has always been home. So at times when we are not home, me and Brenda, and Miranda is home with the maids, I would tell her, you read from daddy's room, be near him. 
would organize the medicines AM, PM in a tablet organizer. I leave them behind with Miranda and I would tell her, ensure that such and such, a, such and such a time your daddy takes this medicine. Indeed, Miranda would do so. She would wake up the dad. Daddy, it's time for your medicines. She brings the water and that kind of medicine, that very type. Dad, it's time to take medicine. She would make sure she wakes him up and would make sure the dad has swallowed medicine as young as she is. Before bedtime, she knew that daddy ha drinks during night he needs three liters. So before she would retire to bed, she would come with a packet of splash and water and put it beside the bed for the dad to take throughout the night. She, because we are sleeping with her in the same room. She took the, she would take the initiative to wake up in the night, daddy, Wake up and drink. That, that is my Miranda. Baby, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for always loving daddy and taking care of him. Thanks to all my other kids. But Miranda has been wonderful. God gave us a gift. We prayed and prayed for Miranda, and finally she arrived. I'll thank my, our best man, and my matron here, Madame Grace Mayanja, and Mr. Anselmo Mai. Thank you very much. As a family, on behalf of my family, we thank you. Your God sent Saints Estate. Thank you very much. Madam Administrator Kajansi Progressive. Thank you for giving my lovely husband a chance. And he comes to Kajansi Progressive. Because I met him through Kajansi Progressive. I'm also a family. Ne? Don't say that it was a teacher, student. <laughs> it was not like that place. <laughs> Sorry. It was after they ha she had left school. <laughs> I changed school. I I kuruba chamu gueri, muevale muevale muno. My family is so grateful. Thank you for always being there for us. We rarely come here, not because we don't want, but at times it's because of work. Thank you very much. Our aunts in Toro, from Toro. Thank you very much for always being here with us. Osima, thank you. Thank you very much. I love you. Fellow mourners, 
thank you all for coming. Thank you for coming. Send of my husband, Titus Kajura. The clergy. Thank you, Father Nicholas, for leading this mass. Father Paul from Gayaza Parish. I met Father Paul like a week back. He came for prayers at our home. He's really been good to us just in these few weeks when he, when he came to know us. He has been very supportive. I needed a letter to go to Lubaga. He made sure I get it. When he told me, I would like to come and be there when you're sending, yeah, when we are laying Titus to his final home. I was like, Father, thank you very much. Thank you, Father. And lastly, I thank God for Titus's life. I thank God for bringing Titus into my life. As you all see, Titus found me fresh and he has left me fresh. Yeah. Titus has looked after me. Titus has given me everything. Yeah. Ephesians 5 says, a man should love his, a husband should love his wife. Titus has done so a hundred percent. I have never lacked. I have not lacked anything. Even when he's on his deathbed. Even when he was in ICU and he could speak. One day I was going to take a bus. A bus takes like one and, and a half hours to where I was sleeping, residing. He told me, Irene, I know we need to save some money, but it's too late. Use, you, use Uber. He was always concerned about my life. Titus Abad de Mugabe. My family, our what day? Taina gua what day? The wife of the man who is going to marry me. The radio did what day? The radio He has loved my family unconditionally. He has loved my friends. Titus Baba if he has ever annoyed someone, I'm really, really sorry on his behalf. Now I tell her I would be knowing because me and Titus. I know I knew everything about Titus. Whether in office or his other life, personal life, whether good or bad. I was his first confidant. I love you, Titus, and we'll, all, we'll always love you as I promised you. And my dear, lovely Titus, so rest in peace.
temptations, hidden snares often take us unawares, and our hearts are made to bleed for some thoughtless word or deed, and we wonder why the test when we try to do our best, but we'll understand it better by and by. By and by. Peace. 
Yeah. 